How does menopause affect sexual life? What about sexual desire during menopause? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. Menopause can affect women's sexual life, with possible decreases in sexual desire and vaginal dryness due to hormonal changes. Changes in sexual response may also arise, requiring more time or stimulation. Symptoms such as hot flashes and mood changes may indirectly influence intimacy. Sexual desire may decrease in some women during menopause due to hormonal changes. However, many women experience a rekindling of their sex lives after menopause, and there are various treatment options and approaches to maintaining sexual satisfaction. Menopause can affect women's sexual life, with possible decreases in sexual desire and vaginal dryness due to hormonal changes. Changes in sexual response may also arise, requiring more time or stimulation. Symptoms such as hot flashes and mood changes may indirectly influence intimacy. In the cultural context of some East Asian countries like Japan and South Korea, sex education may be taboo and limited due to the influence of conservative social norms and a culture of modesty. In Japan, sexual education focuses on preventing sexual harassment and online exploitation, with an emphasis on mutual respect and privacy protection in the digital world. Kama Sutra in Music Some song lyrics and music videos make references to the Kama Sutra, using its concepts and positions as metaphors for sensuality and passion. Latex and Leather Clothing Fetishism Latex and leather clothing fetishism involve sexual attraction towards tight and shiny garments, such as latex suits or leather jackets. These garments may symbolize power, dominance, or simply be aesthetically appealing to those with this fetish. In indigenous communities in Latin America, sex education may be integrated into initiation ceremonies and traditional rituals, transmitting knowledge about sexuality in a culturally relevant and respectful manner. Male and female orgasm. Although there are similarities in the physiology of orgasm between men and women, there are also significant differences, such as duration and intensity, as well as the ability to experience multiple orgasms, which vary from person to person. Masturbation and mental health. Masturbation can have positive effects on women's mental health by helping reduce anxiety, improve mood, and promote relaxation. Masturbation. During menstrual cycle, some women find that masturbation can alleviate symptoms of premenstrual syndrome, PMS, and menstrual cramps by releasing endorphins and reducing muscle tension. Masturbation. During pregnancy, Many women continue to masturbate during pregnancy as it can help alleviate sexual tension and maintain intimacy with their partners. In Middle Eastern countries, sexual education may be a taboo subject and subject to cultural and religious restrictions, making access to accurate information on sexual and reproductive health difficult. Medications and side effects. Some prescribed medications, such as antidepressants, antipsychotics, and medications for high blood pressure, can have side effects that include erectile dysfunction. Myths about virginity. Virginity is a socially constructed concept and can have different meanings for different people and cultures. There is no one way to define the loss of virginity, and it does not have to be exclusively associated with vaginal penetration. Myths and taboos. Throughout history, female masturbation has been surrounded by myths and taboos. However, it is increasingly recognized as a normal and healthy part of female sexuality. It is important to challenge and overcome these stigmas to promote a positive attitude towards sexual self-exploration in women. Object fetishism. This type of fetish involves sexual attraction to inanimate objects, such as shoes, underwear, lingerie, sex toys, or other everyday items. Orgasm control toys. 
Some sex toys are designed to help individuals control their arousal and delay orgasm, such as penis rings with adjustable vibration or resistance training devices. Physical exercise and erectile function. Regular physical activity and aerobic exercise can improve erectile function by enhancing cardiovascular health and increasing blood flow throughout the body, including the penis. Pornography addiction. There has been debate about whether pornography can be addictive, with some studies suggesting that excessive consumption can lead to psychological dependence similar to other addictions. Power and submission fantasies. Many people have sexual fantasies involving power and submission roles, where they enjoy assuming control or being controlled in the bedroom. These fantasies can range from soft scenarios to more intense BDSM practices. Prevention and timely treatment are crucial for controlling the spread of sexually transmitted diseases. Awareness campaigns, access to sexual and reproductive health services, and sexual education are key components of efforts to address this public health issue. Promotion of self-knowledge. The Kama Sutra is not just about sexual activity with another person, but also emphasizes the importance of self-knowledge and personal exploration as crucial elements for a fulfilling and satisfying sex life. Psychological origins. Fetishes can have different psychological origins, from early childhood experiences to subconscious associations developed over time. Some studies suggest that fetishes may arise as coping mechanisms to deal with anxiety or stress. Rediscovery in the digital age. With the advent of the internet, the Kama Sutra has experienced a resurgence online with numerous websites, blogs, and resources dedicated to exploring and sharing its teachings in a modern context. Rhythm and Technique. In foreplay, rhythm and technique are important for providing pleasure and arousal. Changing the intensity and speed of caresses and kisses can maintain interest and prolong pleasure. Role playing. Some couples enjoy role playing during foreplay, where they can explore different fantasies and erotic scenarios, such as doctor patient play, teacher student, or clandestine encounters. Search trends. Online pornography platforms provide data on user search trends, revealing changing interests and preferences regarding genres, actors, and scenes. Sensory experience. Some women prefer sexual positions that stimulate multiple senses, such as sight, smell, and touch, which can intensify their sexual experience. Sensual massages. Body massages can be an extremely sensual form of foreplay for women, Using aromatic oils and gentle movements can relax the body and increase sexual arousal. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality.